let's take a look at this problem. We got uh, eight fifteenths minus three tenths. We're adding, subtracting uh, fractions of different denominators. So our first step: figure out what your uh, LCD is and rewrite each fraction with that new denominator. Uh, LCD least common denominator of fifteen and ten. Now our first step in finding the LCD is do the prime factorization of each number. 15 is 3 times 5 and 10 is 2 times 5. You want to see the tree break down of those. Uh, 15, 3 times 5, 3 is prime so we circle it, 5 is prime so we circle it. 10 is 2 times 5, 2 is prime so we circle it, 5 is prime so we circle it. Our LCD, we start with our first prime, 2. We're looking for the greatest number of twos in a single line. There's none here, one here, so the greatest number of twos in a single line is one. We go to our next prime, three. I'm looking for the greatest number of threes in a single line. There's one here, there's none here, so the greatest number of threes in a single line is one. Then I go to the five. I'm looking for the greatest number of fives on a single line. There's one here, there's one here, so the greatest number of fives on a single line is one. Keep in mind, we're not counting how many there are total. We're looking for the greatest number of them on a single line. Uh, 2 times 3 is 6, times 5 is 30. So we're going to rewrite each fraction with our new denominator. Now you look at your old denominator and you ask, what did you multiply by to get your new one? So we went from 15 to 30. We multiplied the bottom part by 2. So we have to multiply the top part by 2. On our second fraction, we got 10, we went to 30. We multiplied the bottom part by 3. So we have to multiply the top part by 3. Well, 8 times 2 is 16, so we've got 16 over 30, minus 3 times 3 is 9 over 30. Now they have the same denominator, so I'm going to add or subtract the top part. So in this problem, i got 16 minus 9 over 30. And um, 16 minus 9, was that, 7 over 30. And we still don't need to do step number three here. Uh, step three is to simplify a fraction. There's nothing to simplify. So 7 30 is our answer.